Hey everybody, Thomas Joseph here again with another pantry hack for you. I'm sure you have one of these jars in your refrigerator, Pepidou peppers. They're one of my favorite things, and I love them in salads, I love to just snack on them, but today I'm gonna show you three creative ways to use Pepidou peppers in some recipes you may have never thought of before. The first, cornbread. Pepidou peppers are a great replacement for pickled jalapeno peppers. They'd be fantastic here and they add a little bit of tanginess, pungency that's really, really great and complements the sweet cornbread. This second recipe is kind of unique. If you like tequila, here's a pepidou margarita for you. So two ounces of the best quality tequila, one ounce of Cointreau, which is an orange liqueur, the juice of one lime, and for a little bit more acidity and flavor, about a tablespoon of the Pepidou brine. So that should be good. And now just to shake it with a little bit of ice to really get it nice and cold, and then pour it over more ice in a salt room glass and garnish with a lime wedge, and of course, a pepidou pepper so that people will know they're drinking something really unique. And there you have it, a really tasty, tasty cocktail that's very, very different. Another thing that you can do with pepidous is make a pesto or a paste with them. So in a small food processor here, I'm gonna add about a quarter of a cup of pepidou peppers. And again, I'm gonna use about a tablespoon of the, the pickling liquid here, the brine, half of a smashed clove of garlic, and a quarter of a cup of toasted blanched almonds. And I'm going to just season up with a little bit of salt and pepper, and a third of a cup of the best quality olive oil that you have. I'm gonna eyeball it here. That looks good to me. And process this up until it's a nice paste. I have eight ounces of spaghetti. I'm gonna add a little bit of pasta water that I reserved from cooking the pasta, about a half of a cup of that starchy liquid, three cups of baby arugula, and three quarters of a cup of crumbled feta cheese. And I'm just gonna to toss this together What's really nice here is that the pesto paste is really creamy. So this looks delicious, it smells great. So there you have it, three wonderful recipes, a delicious pasta, flavorful cornbread, and a fantastic margarita made with pepidous. I'm sure you'll never have a jar of pepidous left in your refrigerator again. Thanks for watching and comment below with any kitchen conundrums that you may have or reach out to me at hashtag kitchen conundrums and I will answer all of the questions you may have. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Do you have a kitchen conundrum that you need solved? Well, if you do, write in the comment section below and as always, click subscribe.